Did you know this about pistachios? Eating just two pistachios before bed helps with sleep as they are the most melatonin rich food ever recorded. Eating a whole handful of pistachios is like taking a huge dose of melatonin supplement. So that's an interesting one to know isn't it? Truly appalling decision to extend Mark Carney's term at the Bank of England. <clears throat> he is a Remainer who can we, how can we take his government seriously? How can we take seriously man how can we take seriously man with economics degree from Harvard, 13 years with Goldman Sachs, ministerial experience in the Canadian government, five years government governor of the Bank of Canada and five years governor of the Bank of England? Asked man beaten in election by a candidate dressed as dolphin. <clears throat> Need money for college. Need college for job. Need job for money. Who the hell designed this system? Well, when it says, who the hell designed this system? I think it's not far off the mark. <clears throat> Inventions, zero. Discoveries, zero. Breakthroughs, zero. Proven theories, zero. Fraud. The Jesuits took him from zero to hero. You want me to pri be pri the Prime Minister of the United Kingdom? The United Kingdom of Kazaria would be a more adept description. Monsanto's Roundup is also in vaccines. And there's the list if you want to have a look through it. No wonder people are dying, kids are dying, having their allergic reactions. It's a poison. <coughs> Now that this next subject I'm going to be doing a whole video on later, but for the time being. Damning sex abuse report says children were failed despite decades of evidence. The independent inquiry into child sexual abuse says there are still weaknesses. A major inquiry into the abuse of children in care who said that the both the city and county council failed to stop what was taking place despite decades of evidence. The independent inquiry into child sexual abuse, ICSA, has today, Wednesday, July 31st, published its report into historical abuse in residential and foster care across Nottinghamshire. It concluded that the sexual abuse of children was widespread during the 70s, 80s and 90s and is still going on to this day and that victims were failed by Nottingham City Council, Nottinghamshire County Council and Nottinghamshire Police. All three of them conspired to cover it up. It wasn't an accident, it wasn't we just didn't do it, it was a cover up by the three of them. The abuse included repeated rapes and sexual assaults. Professor Alex J, Alexis J, Chair of the Inquiry said, for decades children who were in the care of the Nottinghamshire councils suffered appalling sexual and physical abuse inflicted by those who should have nurtured and protected them. Those responsible for overseeing the care of children failed to question the extent of sexual abuse or what action was being taken. Despite decades, and let me just say that again, 70 years it is more accurate but they say decades because they don't want you to know it's been going on that long and probably longer but we have evidence it takes back 70 years of evidence and many reviews showing what needed to change neither of the councils learnt from their mistakes not mistakes they knew what was going on they deliberately turned a blind eye and that every single one of them should be sacked the whole top lot of them should be gone. The men and women that usually work, generally work for the council, are usually pretty good. Those at the top are nothing but corrupt and should be gone from both the city and the county councils. And I mean the ones that are there today, because they're as, as, as guilty as those that allowed it to happen. The report stated that the 350 people who gave evidence of abuse to ICSA, which is also looking at areas like the Roman Catholic Church of Westminster, 
was largest number of specific alleged allegations of child sexual abuse in a single investigation that the inquiry has considered to date. <clears throat> they were all involved and those that are there now, it's like you've got David Mellor, Mellon for the uh, City Council, you've got the woman for Kay for the County Council. They knew about it. They're, Mellor, for, Mellor, for instance, he was on the executive branch. He knew exactly what was going off. He's one of them. Police put 11-year-old epileptic boy in leg restraints and handcuffs after seizure. So he's having a seizure, so the cops thought, oh, we'll lock him up and you know, handcuff him and put him in restraints. An epileptic and highly disturbed 11-year-old boy was put in leg restraints and handcuffs by police officers after seize, uh, suffering a seizure, a court has heard. A judge raised significant concern over the restraint which continued as the child was taken to hospital. Care proceedings at the Family Division of the High Court in London heard that the child, known as N, had been taken to visit a potential school on 8th of March. Mr Justice MacDonald said the boy had already been restrained four times at one point for 20 minutes at his care home that morning and his behaviour escalated considerably after arriving at the school. Whilst in a hood, a hold, N suffered a toxic cl 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 clonic seizure and paramedics were called, said ruling a ha handed down on Thursday. And the cops should be sh sacked for that. Oh my God. They're the descendants of the, or they are mimicking the Amorites, the Amorites, AKA the Canaanites. Some of the most wicked people to ever walk the face of the earth. Worshippers of Moloch and Baal. Dear God, this battle is for the human race. Epstein's temple ties it all together. And let's hope that Epstein's temple destroys it helps bring it all down <clears throat> paraquat pot the true story of how the u.s government tried to kill weed smokers with a toxic chemical in the 1980s when people talk about killer weed that's typically understood to mean really good weed but due to US government policies that started in the 1970s and extended through the, to the, of the eight, most of the 80s, marijuana fields were being sprayed with a chemical that can actually kill you. They've always been trying to kill us. The chemical known as Paraquat is a herbicide sprayed over mar marijuana fields in Mexico in the 70s with a the aid of the US money and US provided helicopters and over marijuana fields in Georgia in the 1980s under the direction of Reagan administration but normally anything poisonous enough to kill plants is also toxic enough to kill humans and that is the case with Paraquat so just bear in mind that Monsanto uh, glyphosate is being sprayed on the food that they're then giving you it's a poison and if it poisons insects it poisons you paraquat is an organic acid that is used as a herbicide it kills green plant tissue or on contact when sprayed on plants paraquat is tasteless and odorless and invisible in other words you wouldn't be able to tell if the weed that you were smoking had been sprayed with paraquat <clears throat> now, this is ongoing at the moment. The billionaire who creates, uh, creators of Google have invited a who's who of A-list names, including former President Barack Obama, Prince Harry, Leonardo DiCaprio and Katy Perry, to the Sicilian seaside for a mega party there dubbed Google Camp. The three-day event will focus on fighting climate change. <laughs> <laughs> Bullshit. Though it's unknown how much time will the attendees will spend discussing their own effect on the environment, such as the scores of private jets they arrive in and the mega yachts many have been staying on. Everything is about global warming. That is the major topic this year, a source told The Post. Was Barbara Bush the daughter of famous Satanist Alistair Crowley? 
The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. Job 924. The Bush family are by far the greatest example of a successful American crime family. No other American family can claim the kind of success that the Bush family has over the past century. We must give credit where credit is due, right? Samuel Bush was a very successful businessman. He was skull and bones, I believe. He was instrumental in organising the military industrial complex with the Hume Har Harriman family and the Remington Gun and Ammo Company. Together, they conspired to orchestrate World War I and made me many billions of dollars in 1917 money that would make them, them trillionaires by today's standards, which they in fact are. Corruption. <clears throat> Teacher traumatizes six year old by telling her there is no such thing as boys or girls. This has gone on far too, this is ridiculous. These teachers want sacking if they're going to do that. Even if they've been told to do it and they do it, then they want sacking because they're not doing the job they're supposed to be doing. Ottawa, June 19th, 2019. The parents of a six year old girl who was upset after her teacher told her class, there is no such thing as boys and girls have filed a human rights complaint against the Ottawa Carlton District School Board, alleging the teacher discriminated by creating a poisonous, poisoned environment. The child's mo mother, Pamela Buffon, told Barbara Kay in this, a story published in the post-millennial that her daughter became increasingly distressed after her teacher sh uh, showed the class a video he, he, she and they gender queer kids stuff to, to the six-year-old student in January 2018. The video states that some people aren't boys or girls and that there are people who do not feel like a she or he. Kate reported. They're attacking the kids. FBI. Sex with children is the fastest growing illegal business in America. Children are being targeted and sold for sex in America every day. John Ryan, National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. Children, young girls, some as young as nine years old, are being brought and sold for sex in America. The average age for a young woman being sold for sex is now 13. This is America's dirty little secret, sex trafficking, especially when it comes to the bullying, buying and selling of young girls, has become big business in America, the fastest growing business in organized crime and the second most lucrative commodity traded illegally after drugs and guns. Every two minutes, another child is forced into sex trafficking. That's how they want it. We've got to stop it. We've got to take back this planet once and for all. <clears throat> Five snacks made of petroleum based chemicals linked to ADHD, nervous system issues, allergies and even cancer. The links in description, I'm not going to read this one. Uh, the writing's just not clear enough. So if you want to have a read yourself, links in description as I said. I. Britain beating plastic bags. 90% drop since 5p charge was introduced. Average person in England now buys j just 10 bags a year from big supermarkets compared with 145 years ago. We're calling time on being a throwaway society, says Environment Secretary. It follows huge falls in Scotland and Wales, which brought in le uh, levy sooner. Now for plastic bottles, call to end addi addiction. Queer Eye Star, Tan France. I'm constantly reminded that I am different. Holidays disruption after BA fails to stop pilot strike. The human cost of undercover police tactics. Labour off our rockers not to back re remain don't be stupid free eric global outcry grows ahead of journalist court hearing today <clears throat> plastic bag use halves in just a year astonishing triumph for mail campaign so it's daily fail if i didn't say Ca uh, cambridge student falls to a death from plane how Telegraph. 
Army trains keyboard warriors for digital war. Soldiers to be deployed on social media battlefield in face of Russian cyber threat. Oh, bullshit. Javid double spending to d turbocharge no deal plans. Wait a minute, if he's got all this money lying around, why have we got homeless? Why have we got kids starving? Shoppers baffled by 58 recycling symbols. Met Mark making excuses over Midland report. That's Operation Midland. Breakfast with Medora helped boost Classic FM. Cambridge student dies in fall from plane. Hong Kong protesters charged with rioting. Aston Martin chief silent over his future. <clears throat> the Guardian. Labour attacks appalling waste as PM adds two billion to No Deal fund. Spending increase to stockpile medicines and recruit border officials. It's vital we intensify our planning to en ensure we are ready. Warning over drugs as six die in three days. Clean up underway after downpours in Yorkshire. The Times. British Airways pilots to strike at peak of summer holidays. Suspects in six sex crimes should be anonymous. Ministers seek to provide protect, re, reputation of accused. Now this is what all that stuff with that guy that apparently accused uh, of paedophilia and then it didn't. This is what it was about. So that they never, uh, um, no, never the names are never released until they, they're found guilty. But of course that's just to protect them because they know it's coming. Well, I'll be damned. City drops swearing ban. <clears throat> Metro. Here to been laden dead. Here to been laden dead. 9-11 mass man's son, 30, had one million bounty on his head. Bin Laden had nothing to do with it. It was the Clintons, the Bush, the whole of them. The CIA, the FBI, Secret Service, uh, Mossad, Israel, Saudi Arabia. It wasn't him. And any research tells you that. 70 stars Harry shows off his flares for fashion. Waste of paper. Amber and Greg mobbed at airport. Another big exclusive flappy hour boozy booze crazed gulls terrorized by the spoon beer garden A student 20 dies falling from plane mirror I'm proof kids must be banned from Lotto mum who won 18 million at 16 backs bid to raise pl playing age to 60 to 18 love I'll sham the scum Victoria's Secret Axe Angel Show. Looks a bit saucy. Exclusive. 1,000 volt shot. What van man? Spark his Citroen wired to zap thieves. Express. British girl 19 dies falling out of plane. Two billion extra boost for no deal. If they got billions just lying around, why have we got homeless? Government to review hated tax to help the younger and older generations. Cut stamp duty to fix home crisis. Markle and Spencer. Megan launches MS close range for. <laughs> Parasites. <clears throat> Financial Times. Irish divide foster rises border poll. Fed cuts rate by a quarter point and signals more easing if needed. Early halt to reduction of balance shows global tremors spur first paring since crisis. Leads and Phil's first business round table who, with roll call of like-minded Brexiteers. <clears throat> and almost finally, a teacher asks her class, what is sex? Johnny got up and said, Sex is a temptation caused by a sensation where a boy sticks his location into a girl's destination to increase the population of the next generation. Do you get my explanation or do you need a demonstration? The teacher fainted. Does anyone else put things in a safe place and then forget where that safe place is? I've done that several times. So safe, you never find it again. <laughs> 
A man checked into a hotel. There was a computer in his room, so he decided to send a mail to his wife. He accidentally typed the wrong email address and without realising, he sent the mail to a widow who ju has just returned from her husband's funeral. The widow decided to check her mail, expecting condolences, messages from relatives and friends. After reading the first message, she fainted. The son rushed into to the room, found his mother on the floor and saw the computer screen which read, to my loving wife, I know you are surprised to hear from me. They have computers here and we are allowed to send mails to loved ones. I've just been checked in. How are you and the kids? The place is really nice, but I'm lonely here. I have made necessary arrangements for your arrival tomorrow. Expecting you, darling. I can't wait to see you.